Hi, this is Robert Heppel from FuneralFuturesWebsites.com with another Funeral Home Website Training Series video. In this short tutorial, I'm going to introduce you to a website called WebResizer.com where you can actually resize images online. And this is how it works. All that you do is go to the website at WebResizer.com forward slash resizer and just like you would be adding an image to an email and as adding it as an attachment, you click the browse button, find your image, and upload it. It will upload, you specify any settings, you click the apply changes, the website will do its thing, and then you can download the image. So let me show you how it works. So here we are at the site, and uh, you can see here that they've just shown here of this example of here's the original picture of this butterfly and then after it was optimized for the web they actually reduced it almost by two-thirds or actually just over two-thirds and a lot of images that are online are not optimized uh, Google's actually cracking down and wants pages to load faster and faster giving the viewer a better experience so we want to make sure that all of our images are optimized so what we do is just click here on the resize photos now and you see the uh, stock image of the giraffe and what we do is just click in here and we're going to optimize this obituary photo then upload it and it'll just take a, uh, a few seconds here it all depends too on how large the photo is and what we want to do is we want to uh, just resize this now it'll give you some uh, general settings here but we can actually scroll down a little bit further and actually create a new size. So for this one, it's a for our online uh, obituary module, and so the standard width is 150. And we can apply the changes, and you can see that this now that it's optimized is 80 percent smaller than the original. Now uh, this is the one that we're going to download, and we just click this link here. But there's some other features that you can use as well. Um, you can you can play with the quality if you want to get something uh, optimized a little bit more but uh, you know this is pretty good this is a very small file so that's not going to be a problem uh, you can also if you want give it that like a black um, black and white effect just press uh, optimize you can even add um, a little bit of sepia to it More if we wanted to do something there. So it has that sepia look, but we're going to change this back to zero and unclick that. And it'll go back to our original. And if you wanted to, you could even add a uh, you could even add a border if you wanted to. that apply changes kind of gives a bit of a border so you can actually pick the the size of the edge the size of the border and the inner edge too but we'll uh, undo all these and just go back to apply changes and we're back to where we want it and then we just click this image and then we save it and it'll download to our uh, to you, our computer and then you can uh, upload it to the website that you need to and that's it so for more information about funeral home websites and training videos visit funeralfutureswebsites.com and if you have a question please email it to me at questions at funeralfuturist.com this is Robin Heppel